Alright, hi out there to all my viewers. Um, this time I'm going to talk about my bike. It's a bit of a rare bike and that. Um, I've just come for a ride. Got all my gear in it. Well, not, I haven't got my body armour. Got my kidney belt down there. Kidney belt's always helpful for my lower back. Getting all ready. Got me good old Audi's knee pads on. And me boots that I got for Christmas. Always, always need safety when you're out in the bush and all that stuff because you never know what's going to go on. Now, as I said, I'm going to talk about my bike this time. Um, I'll give you a picture of it if I can. No, I can't turn it around. Nope. Okay, um, well, my bike is a 2005 KDM 350 EXC Special R. The reason why it's such a long name is I've done some research and there's only exclusively 30 of them built for the Australian market. It is dubbed the 250 but what they've done they put a 350 big ball kit in it. So a little bit more power for just cruising around or if you want to start off learning it's a pretty good bike actually. Um, just so you get a look of it. There it is there. It's a KDM. They're not a bad bike, they're an Austrian bike. Um, this one's a four stroke. I've got it fully registered and insured. I've got my license, so that way I can just jump on it. Um, jump on it, go up bush, go for a ride, not have any worries actually. Which is pretty good. I'll just remove my helmet from there. Helmet's always a safety issue. Make sure you always have your helmet on. Um, so yeah, the main the main thing I got with it is that um, when you look at it, you got your lights, got your indicators. So keep your close indicators. So when you are out bush, um, it is a pretty good um, idea to have. It is water cooled. I've got my little water cool over in the back there. KDM, not a bad bike. It's got to go in. Um, so as you can see on here that's what that's what it is it's a 350 exe special r took me a little while to find out the information about it because not many people have heard of them especially when there's only 30 of them made um at the moment i have tried a um bridgestone battle cross x40 tire as you can see it's a bit worn down i might, might look at trying a different tire maybe pirelli or something and then, um, yeah, hopefully that does a bit better. Fully registered. I've got no dramas about that. Um, KDM. KDMs aren't a bad bike, actually, when you look at it. Being a four-stroke, it's easy enough. I just ride into town, fuel up, and then go. Um, as you see, I've got a bit of decal on it, and a friend gave me these monster stickers, so I thought they'd be perfect for on the bike. My little metal, metal, metal sure. One there, I like it. Keep your chain well lubed up. I've got to give it another bit of a clean. But apart from that, it goes all right. It gets me around that bush. Um, I can sort of keep up with the other boys. I might have to get, have to get some of that checked, actually. It's got to go in for a look next week anyway. So, yeah, pretty much make sure you got all your right gear. When you come up riding, um, I try and maintain your bike. You don't want to get all the way up the bush and have something break down and you've got no way of getting home. Um, the bike does have kick and electric start, which is a bonus. Or if it wants to play up, I'll just roll start it. Um, and that's pretty much it about my bike at the moment. Um, if you have a look on my YouTube page, there'll be a few videos of me actually on the bike riding it. If I can, I might get another one today because I've got my GoPro on the bag and try and get that up later. So pretty much remember just to have fun, um, safety first, everything like that, proper boots. I have knee pads, helmet, gloves, goggles. Oh, the goggles actually are pretty good. A friend of mine told me about these. The brand is actually called 100%. They're actually really good. These ones come with the tint. So, especially for a day like this, they do come in handy. That way you don't have to worry about putting sunny sun underneath your goggles. I've done that for a few years, it's a pain in the ass. Um, 
the air at the moment. I've come for a ride up Columbatty Lookout. Um, doing a quick video, I'll just take you up to this lookout part. It's actually a pretty amazing view. On a really clear day, you can see right to the coast. It's actually not too bad today. You can have a good look around. Right over behind us is all the Great Divide and Range. Um, but no, perfect day, not too hot, not too cold. As you can tell, got the bike down there. Gets me around the place, I'm happy with it, so yeah. Um, if anyone ever gets a chance, get, get your bike, get a license and that, be safe, have a good time. And yeah, just watch out for other people on the road and it. Not for their safety, mainly for yours, because a lot of people on the roads are idiots and bikes don't have much protection. Alright, hope you enjoyed and I'll catch you next time. Bye.